Bonjourno. I get it because it's French. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to part two of Rayman 3 Hoodlum Havoc. That's pretty well, wacky, right? What are we going to be doing in this part then? Well, we are going to continue on through the fairy castle. Oh, that creepy shit? What? Creepy little thing with glow box there. What's up with that? Oh, yeah, that's just what that thing was hiding behind. Ugh. Wait, you can lean in this game? <laughs> well, in first this person game is mode. clearly advanced. It's. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Did you. Oh, shit, I just ran out of my power up because I was doing that. <laughs> yeah, what game. You can't even lean in Call of Duty, mate. So this game You can in Call of Duty Ghosts. Well. Whatever, mate. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, well. <laughs> that was a good Why combat. are we talking about Call of Duty and of Rayman? Uh, well, because Call of Duty inspired a lot of games, mate, didn't it? Um, well, actually, no, that I can't say that considering we talk about all sorts of different games, not giving a fuck about what we're playing. Like, talking about Smash and stuff like that and Spyro, but yeah. I don't know how to zoom in on this. I don't What's know how good? to... Oh, well, fuck that thing. Right, anyway. <laughs> I can't bother that. I love the classic way Rayman climbs things. It's just really cool. Anyway, um, like that's my memories of Rayman Two are largely just climbing up vines of the piranhas. Yeah, it was so cool, wasn't it? I really enjoyed that. Mm. Um, but yeah, Call of Duty has actually inspired me not to make a game as bad as that. Whoa! Yeah, no, shots fired. The thing is, I wouldn't say that because everyone in the world loves Call of Duty, and no one insults it ever except everyone. What was it? Jim Sterling actually had to make an article defending Call of Duty. So. I he didn't have to, but he decided to because whenever anything Call of Duty related got brought up, everyone would just say, oh, it's so shit. Well, know? yeah, but no one what? used to say Apology. that. I used to hate Call of Duty before it was cool, mate. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, get you. Yeah, I know. That's what um, I'm about. Oh, by no, the way, that guy... True. I'm not a fan of COD, really, but, you know, I've, I think that people, lots of people who bash it have never played it. At least you have played it. Yeah, I have. Um, by the way, that do you know the black um, lum guy that just that's the bad guy, just yeah. made a Zelda reference. By the way, oh yeah, he just said to that fairy, um, "Bug off, Z Zelda needs you" or something like that. Really? Yeah. That's not even subtle. That's just. I know. <laughs> there he is, you bastard. Yeah. What a shit. So this. So that's and these are the fairies here, part of the fairy council. And uh, Andre, that what black is this guy, guy doing? he's trying to get to the heart of the world, which is inside the fairy council. And uh, in the center. Yeah, we're trying to stop him. And this woman's got a really fucking annoying voice, bitch. Now, will I be right in saying you catch him, you kill him, and the game ends? Like, just like that? Uh, yeah, that's exactly okay. what happens. Um, cool. Actually, you do sort of catch him, but in a weird way. We'll show you in a minute. Yeah. Also, he. He makes a Spider-Man reference here. Where? Wow. Uh, right there, he says, uh, "If if I was you, I would call it quits and head straight for the Rayman 2 audition." That's what he actually says. Very nice. Yeah, I know. Is the game just full of those weird references? Uh, I, hope, I hope not, but it probably is, to be honest. You hope not. No, well, yeah. Well, I hope it doesn't keep doing that because there's no other great way to date something than make it fucking reference film that's coming out around the time or whatever. Yeah, that's true. No, it's. I think it's quite cool though, because it means when you go back and play it, you can be like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's what was relevant too. at the time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Those so... Those Spider-Man films suck though. <laughs> Tobey Maguire is a great actor. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. <laughs> Tobey Maguire is great. Tommy Maguire was that? <laughs> Do you know what? I've just Tommy realized... Tommy Maguire is great. Do you know what? I've just realised? We were talking about William Dafoe in the last part, who's in Spider-Man. <laughs> No, we're talking about fucking Peter Parker. I think it's just like a running thing. Yeah. That is so unintentionally great. It's fantastic. It is, yeah. Uh, My two favourite actors. I think I can't... The thing is, Spy, the first Spider-Man film of that trilogy, I can't even remember if I've seen it or not. And I, I, I still, to this day, I've been trying to work out for about the past year and a half whether I've seen that film or not, and I'm still not sure. <laughs> that is great. Yeah. Right, I'm just going to be I've back. I've only seen the second one. I'm just going to be back one second. Right. Okay, sorry about that, Alex. So what oh, just happened there, basically? I sound out of breath now, because I just ran up and down the stairs. I'm so unfit. Uh, basically, what happened was uh, Andre, the little black guy, flew straight into Glowbox's mouth. What an arse. 
Yeah, well, he did it by accident. So now he's stuck inside Glowbox. Are you inside Glowbox now? No, 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 I'm not. I was going to say, I was like, what the fuck's going on here? Andre is. And uh, as you can see over there, they're throwing Glowbox up and down. And these guys have the Tinsies. So you is remember the, these guys? Yeah, yeah, of course I remember these guys. Possibly so, like, the most famous thing about Rayman. Other than is that what you mean when you say that you sort of catch him? Yeah. So he's like caught inside Glowbox. Oh, so yeah, they're throwing up and down like so. He's he's like say he's like um inside Glowbox and you obviously you need to get him out. Well, why are they chucking him up and down? Are they trying to get him out? I don't know. They're just maniacs. It's like a aren't chest they? buster. Mm. I recently saw Alien actually, not that long ago. Have you seen Alien? Mm-hmm. And I've also seen I I watched Alien and Aliens with some friends recently for the first time and. Really, really good films, even. Yeah, still. they are, aren't they? They are good films. The first one's definitely a lot better than the second one, though. The Works. second one is very American. I don't. Like, I can't even like. No, there's any problem with which. Being I just remember the first one is. Uh, it okay, is you classic. know. What? I I don't want to use the term Americanized. It sounds like I'm talking against America. I meant Hollywoodized. Yeah. Um. And the first the first one's a lot better. I think. Mm. But the second, but Aliens is still good. Like I said, don't get me wrong, Hollywood films aren't that bad, but mm. unless you find typical Hollywood crap films like Fast and Furious, which is just great film, that is great disgusting. series. Disgusting. Um, yeah, and uh, Murphy then just said, "See you for round four. But um, over how much time have we got left? Four minutes. Okay, well let's do the craziest part of this entire game. Right already. Wait, well, they, these are sections that happen like every time. So we're going through the surfing sections. Have you seen these before? Yeah. No, but that was bits like this in um, Rayman 2, sort of. Like Not slight quite like this, though. These are no, this mental. This is just trippy as hell. Yeah. So, um, also, uh, you probably won't be able to notice through the video, but he sort of like surfs on that. You know those um, things in Rayman 2, those little rockets that have legs? Oh, yeah, yeah. It sort of looks like one of them. I don't know how... Oh, shit, I died. I don't know how similar it is. Also, on that, you know that Did You Know uh, Gaming Rayman edition that came out recently? I found... am, yeah, but... Oh, right, yeah, well, I no. found out that, you know the Enterprise from Star Trek? No, not really. I know, like, nothing about Star oh, okay. Trek. okay. Well, it's like, it's like one of the ships in it. It's, it, well, it's the most famous ship in it. Um, right. It's actually, like, in the background here somewhere. It's, like, really weird. It's such a weird... Another like, reference. Thing. Yeah, but it's, like... It's really hard to notice, and it doesn't really make any sense whatsoever. Yeah, that kind of like a bit strange. Rayman is about as different from Star Trek as you can get. Yeah, Rayman's it's quite different anyway. Methods. Like this is just such a strange part. Yeah. Do you know the uh, band Groove Armada? No. Oh, okay, I'm not surprised. I feel that. ignorant. I just don't. I feel like I don't know anything. No, that's it. fine. They're not really that famous, I would say. No, no offense to Groove Armada if you're watching this. I know we. Uh, are... Yeah, I'm sure Groove Armada are watching. Yeah, this. please uh, subscribe if you are watching Groove Armada. Um, no, but yeah. So um, yeah, they did like the main song of this gun uh, for this what? game. I just missed uh, the massive uh, green gem. This? I know it's crazy, isn't it? I just ma missed the massive green gem as well. So trippy. Yeah, man. it's cool, isn't it? And there's like, like loads yes. of sections like this in the game. And now we're done. And I only got 45 seconds. So, so hold on. So what's the scoring based off? Like it says you've Combos got this and stuff. Time. You know, like the combo. Right. So hmm. what, picking up collectibles close together or something. Yeah, that's how the combo thing stays up and stuff. Okay. But also, as we're going to see now, um, cages return from Rayman 2. With the Tintsies stuck in the cages. Uh, they've, they've been in all of the main series games, haven't they? Oh yeah, sorry, they have, yeah. Yeah. So now, like, throughout the game, you have Glowbox with you, and he has the main villain inside Glowbox. So that's quite a cool little, um, thing. I don't remember many things where that's done. Like, many Where's stories. Where's the shit out of Glowbox? Yeah. Mate, I hate Glowbox. So these are the main enemies of the game. I own that one, then, because I was fully charged. Hmm. And you can curl Excellent. your... Huh? Excellent. I know, inside. exactly. <laughs> and you can curl your fists, by the way. I did do it in the last part, but I didn't mention it because we were talking about William Defoe, which is way more important. But, of course. Um, yeah, so there's quite a few different like sort of things you can do in this game. 
I um, remember there was a really random Rayman spin-off game called like Rayman M or something. Wasn't yes, there? that was a racing game. I have that. Or oh, I had. Is that any good? I don't. Uh, it was that. as good as you expect it would be. It's My, like an on foot racing owned game. It. it was like there was also a fighting part to it as well. I didn't think much of it when he played it, but I don't know. Hmm. Well, from what I remember, it was a bit of shit. Anyway, so <laughs> here's the first um, unboxing. Oh, this cool. It's got the same little like icon as the other games when yeah. you open a kit. And uh, they all have sort of like weird different system. Like those ones are kind of like I suppose Scottish. I don't want to be really ignorant and get it wrong, but I guess they're Scottish anyway. There's also well, another one around. Well, what do you mean the accents? Yeah, because I can hear them saying help somewhere. Uh, yeah, so they have like accents and like ridiculous tropes that like are supposed to show that there's some sort of different. Different, yeah, different from the other ones. Um, right, it well, that's been about 10 minutes now. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, right. um, I need to go back and get that bloody thing anyway. So, when we come back, we'll be... Con oh, I can just go this way. When we come back, we will go through the rest of this level and oh, find the first doctor. So, yeah, Ooh. this game like consists of trying to find different doctors to help get the thing out of Glowbox. Alright, so, anyway. cool. See you then. Yeah, see you for the next part. Bye. Bye.